what's going on guys um got a lot of recaps you got a little bit of mail in and i went to a card show got some really nice pickups and i opened two boxes uh one of which was this top Grid iron legend so i'm using that as a background today um let's see i'm gonna do the mail first um i went to target the other day and bought a pack of tops prime and i got a marcel darius jumbo jer or whatever regular jersey numbered out of 318 and with that i also got a aj green rookie and a delone carter rookie um let's see then i got this in the mail today for a really good deal uh i got this really nice cam newton signed 8x10 picture on draft day um, pretty nice autograph there. Um, so that was cool to get. And then for the show, um, I saved the uh, the quick pickups that I got from the show for last because they're probably the best. Um, and do the recap of this box first. Um, I've seen a few boxes of this stuff open before, and it was like pretty horrible. It was pretty bad. Uh, I think this is probably the worst product that's ever come out for a long time. But, knowing that, I bought it anyway. And mine didn't really prove any any better than the rest. But, um, it was, yeah, it was pretty bad. But, uh, this is what the base looks like. These are the base cards, in case you haven't seen. You get about one of these thick cards in every pack. And it really shouldn't be called Topps Legends, because it's really not... So that's what those thick things look like. I got a stack this big of rookies. I already pulled out all the good rookies, which I'll show in a second. But I got like a rookie of practically everybody. And then they got these inserts, Gridiron Leg Legacies. I got Joe Montana, John Elway, Emmett Smith, Marcus Allen. Then they have Aspiring Legacies. Legacies. And then this... Legendary com Combos, Edmund Gates and Daniel Thomas. When you say Legendary Combos, I'm thinking Dan Marino, Bob Greasy. Again, Legendary Combos, Austin Pettis and Titus Young. Doesn't fit. You got two numbered cards in the whole box. I got Charles Woodson out of 299 and a Felix Jones red out of 75. So that was the rookies and inserts. And then for the good rookies... Um, probably my favorite thing out of the whole box. Uh, Cam Newton rookie, a uh, Julio Jones rookie, Jake Locker, Blaine Gabbert, and Mark Ingram. So you got one of the, one of each of the main guys there. And then you get four hits. Uh, I guess from worst to best. Darren Evans, uh, rookie auto from the Colts. Not numbered. DeLone Carter jersey. Uh, not numbered. Colin Kaepernick jersey, not numbered. And a Blaine Gabbert jersey, not numbered. So the fact that none of this stuff is numbered and you get three of the exact same jersey cards in the box. And this is not just my box. I mean, I watched Chris at the Hobby Box open a lot. And this is pretty much what it looked like. I knew that going into it. I just bought it anyway. Um, so I wouldn't really recommend it, but... You do get a lot of rookies, so for that reason, it's okay. Then, I got a box of 2011 Press Pass, 5 autographs per box. Now, you'd think this one would be even worse because it's Press Pass. Everybody thinks Press Pass is bad. This box was actually better, I think, by far than this. And, um... I got, these are all the rookies and inserts, I didn't take them out, but I did count, I ended up getting 8 Cam Newton rookies, which are PC for me, you know, and um, I did get a ton of like Blaine Gabbert and Jake Lockers, they're all in here, so I think for the, the fact that these boxes are only $45 uh, for where I got them, and you get all the star rookies, even though they're from Press Pass, you still, it's a decent deal. 
And then I did get my five autographs, and I got an extra hit, too. So, um, my extra hit was a Gridiron Gamers jersey, number 225, a Ryan Mallet. And then my five autographs, I guess, from worst to best. Um, an Aaron Williams, not numbered. Then a uh, Roy Halu Jr., not numbered. Um, then a Dane Sonsenbacher. Blue autograph, numbered out of 50. That was pretty cool, actually, because he's playing decent right now. And then a pretty cool Shane Viren, Viren, Red Ink. Numbered out of 199. So I, when I pulled this, I thought that was a hit of the box, just because it was Red Ink. Uh, I didn't think it was going to be anything else good. But then I got... The hit of the box, and believe it or not, as sad as it is, probably my best pull of the year so far. I've had horrible luck this year, but, um, so I was pretty happy with this, I guess. Uh, Julio Jones, silver out of 199. So, um, I mean, for press pass, it was not a bad, not a bad box. You know, Julio Jones, the red ink, and this one was okay out of 50. And I got the extra hit. So that's it. Oh, that's not it. Um, get my pickups from the show, too. I... Uh, let's see. I uh, can't find it at the moment. Alright. Um, can't find it at the moment, but I traded for a Tops Platinum Jumbo Patch of Daniel Thomas, the Dolphins. No, it was like numbered out of 36 Jumbo Four Color Patch. is really nice. I'm actually getting a little worried why I can't find it right now. Um, and then for my Matthew Stafford autograph that I had, if you guys seen it, I traded it. I was going to trade it straight up for this card, but I got the guy to throw in a John Baldwin Quad Auto from Cr Prime. Quad jersey autograph out of 515, a Julio Jones Marcel Darius duel, and a Matt Ryan dual jersey, rookie jersey. And the main card I traded for the Stafford was this really sick uh, Sam Bradford shoe football jersey auto from certified freshman fabric. Numbered out of 50. Probably won't trade that. I'm, I'm keeping, I got this. I've been holding on to this for a while too. This Sam Bradford, number 22 out of 22. I really think he's going to be something someday. I'm hoping, so I'm holding on to his stuff. Uh, but that's it. Anything else is for trade. The hits of the boxes are for trade.